How are you, Junior 2? This is our first lesson today. The name of the lesson is the bar graph. What is the bar graph? Here we have a drawing. This is a graph. And we can see colors and the numbers. We will know each thing of this means what. At the first, as we have our names, my name is Miss Randa, your name is uh, Dahlia, and so on. Also, the graph must have a name. A name is the title of the bar graph. Here, the name of this bar graph is Birds in the Form. So, now we know that we will count the number of birds in the form. We have a picture here. We have many birds. What will we do? We will count each similar birds. Birds with the same type like this. Here we have this, the same type. We, we will count how many? One, two, three, four, five. So we have five ducks. How many chicks, for example, here we have one, two, three, four, and so on. So we will count the number of birds that has the same type. Then we will go to this. We have here this line. This is horizontal line. What is horizontal line? It's line like this. This is horizontal. It's like when we sleep. And this is the vertical line. It's like this. Like when you wake up. When you wake up like this. And when you sleep like this. So horizontal. It's go from right to left or from left to right. And the vertical goes from up to down or from down to or for, uh, from down to up or from up to down. This is the two lines that we have in the bar graph. Then on the, on the vertical line we draw it here, we write numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And on the horizontal line we draw it the type of birds that we have in the form. And we have, this is the bar, this called the bar. It's divided into small parts. We will count here, these birds, we have how many of them? We will find them seven. So we will go to the, this bar for this type of bird and we will color one, two, three, four, five, six, till we reach number seven and stop. So, if I don't have the picture here, and I, I have only this bar graph, and I looked here for this, I can conclude, I can know that the type of this bird, the number of them is 7. Because the bar graph of this type colored to number 7. Okay? Now, this chicken. How many chickens do we have we have only three. So we will go to the bar graph for the chicken at the horizontal line. And we will go vertical and color how many parts. We will color three parts because we have three chickens. One, two, three and stop. We will stop here at number three. So again, if we don't have this picture and we have only this graph. What can we know? We will know that this chicken, the number of these chickens, is only three. Now we have these ducks. We counted them and we found them five. So we will go to the horizontal line and we will choose the ducks and we will color how many parts at the vertical line at the bar, we will color five parts. One, two, three, four, and till we reach number five and we will stop here. Finally, these chicks, we found them four. So we will go to the chicks 
on the horizontal line or horizontal axis and we will color one two three four and stop so again in the bar graph we must know three things the first thing is the title of the graph this is the name of the graph and we must know what we will draw at the horizontal axis this is line this line called horizontal axis and we must know what we write we will write at the vertical axis yes so this is number of birds at the vertical axis this must we must know these three things then we will color each bar with different colors to know how many birds do we have so let's try to solve this here we have what is this this called the title of the graph animals in the garden so now we know that we will count the animals of the garden which animals which animals any animals no these animals only so this is the horizontal axis we will write here animals and we will write here number of animals number of animals in the garden and this is the type of animals okay now here we have this cat how many cats can we see in this picture there's only one cat so we will go to drawing of cat and we will color only one part in this bar then we have this type of animals or this is bird one two three four five only five so we will go to the the vertical line and we will color five of them one two three four five and we will stop here at number five so now we know that how many birds do we have in the garden so we have five birds in the garden and so on by the same way this is this was our first lesson our next lesson is make a bar graph you will make it by yourself you will have a picture and you will do it by yourself color one box for each item in both pages here we have this sea animals what is the sea animals here this is the title of the graph and here we have types of animals in the picture here and here this is the number of animals and we counted here at the vertical line one two three four five six seven eight nine ten okay we will look at this picture and we will count and draw or color by yourself how many type of these animals in the picture and from the bar graph from this graph without looking to the picture we will complete the number of this is what the number of this is what the number of this is what it's very easy without we now we will not look at the picture after we color the bar graph we will solve the questions without looking to the picture we will solve it from the bar graph next we have horizontal bar graph what is horizontal bar graph it's the same bar graph but we will flip it okay we will flip it we will put we will change the numbers of these two labels the number and the type we will exchange their places we will put the vertical line instead the horizontal and the horizontal instead of the vertical so now we will put the numbers here one two three four five six seven eight nine ten add that and right here of course we will change the label here it will be number of birds and here the type of birds we will write it right on it birds okay so if i asked you what is the type of the animal that is we have four only of them so you will go to number four and go up to see which bird of them it's four 
We have four of them. Yes, we have this. If I asked you which bird we have seven of them. So you will go to number seven and go up, up, up till we reach this. This, the bird colored to number seven. So this type, the number of this type of birds is seven. It's very easy lesson. Now we have this bar graph and we want to flip it. We will, we want to put it at the horizontal bar graph. Okay. This is the horizontal that has lines at the horizontal line, has numbers at the horizontal line. We have here names. Sammy, Rose, Yusuf, Ahmed, and Mary, and here number of birds. Each one of these children has number of birds, has seen number of birds. Bird is seen at the park. Sammy saw six birds. Chef, six birds. But Rose saw nine birds. Yusuf saw four birds. And Ahmed saw eight, Mary saw ten birds, okay? Now, we want to put this information at the horizontal graph. We will go to Mary. Mary saw how many? Ten. So we will go to Mary and color till we reach number ten. She will color ten parts at the bar graph till we reach number ten. Then we will go to here, Ahmed. So we will search for Ahmed here. We found it here. And we will go up till we stop here. We stopped at number eight. Use the ruler to know the number at number eight. So we will color this bar graph, this horizontal bar to reach number one, two, three. Count four, five, six, seven, eight eight and stop till we reach number eight and now we have yusuf search for yusuf and see yusuf saw four birds so we will count four bars or four parts here we have rows so nine so we will go to number nine we will count nine parts till we reach number nine and sammy here so six birds so we will go to sammy and color six parts till we reach only number six and we will stop here okay so now here the different graph but the same information okay the same information in both graphs but the graph look different here's the numbers on the vertical line but here numbers is on the horizontal line now we finished three lessons we will stop here. Next time, we will go to table and bar graph. Thank you.